guys welcome to my channel so in today's video we are going to be getting this spare guest bedroom completely cleaned out so i can start setting up my office um so i'm going to bring you guys along with me but if you are not subscribed to this channel go ahead and hit that red subscribe button down below and also feel free to give me a thumbs up if you enjoy my content as well on this channel we talk about NACA this is a lifestyle channel so we talk about a few things we do NACA videos we do lifestyle we do vlogs and we are now doing entrepreneurship videos and I'm so excited um, I've told you guys in a couple of vlogs back that I am going into a new business venture um the t-shirt business so yeah um i am cleaning out this room so i can start getting this room set up to set up my heat press machine that i've had for over a month and i have not used or have not taken out the box and then i'm going to set up some other things that i got from michael's that i'm super excited about um but yeah y'all i am really trying to do this and i am going to oh I'm going to I'm going to do it y'all so let's get started let's go ahead without further ado let's get into the video without all this rambling and yeah let's get this room cleaned up y'all so i got everything cleaned out of the room i started vacuuming as you can see the lines over there but my vacuum died so i have to let it charge up so i can finish this side but for the most part everything is out there's nothing in here like there's such an echo in here because <laughs> there's nothing in here of course but yeah so i am super excited now because I can finally move forward with um, putting my stuff in here now. So super excited about that. Okay, yeah, I am so hot now <laughs> doing all this cleaning, but I don't like um, this color lighting in here. It looks really orangey-ish. And so I'm going to get these lights changed out um, because there is a complete difference between this room and then when you step outside and you're over here in my loft area so as you can see don't mind the stuff on the desk that's going to be cleaned up but as you can see um the color in the loft area and then when you go in the room is orange loft orange now there aren't any lights on this light is off so this will be considered daylight and i really like how this this lighting looks in this area so i think i may find some daylights some daylight lighting to go in these rooms to replace these orange type bulbs so i'm going to let my vacuum charge up and then i'm going to come back and vacuum the rest and then i'm going to the first thing i think i'm going to do is bring my desk in here my old desk um that way i can figure out exactly where i want it to go because i think that's where my printer my printer is already on the desk it's just not sitting on top it has two shelves on the desk underneath but i think i'm going to sit the, the printer on top of the desk i think so i gotta figure that out but yeah so i'm gonna let my vacuum charge up and then i'll be back a little later
so I went ahead and moved the desk in here. I put it on the side where I've already vacuumed. Now I don't know if this is where it's going to stay, but for now, that's where it's at. So my actual work desk, um, I think, I don't know. I don't know where my actual work desk is going to go. So I need to figure that out. But like I said, this desk, my old desk is not going to be right here. I might move it. So I have plenty of time to figure it out. Yeah, I'm going to figure it out. And when I do, um, like I said, that desk may not be here. I might move it. But me and my husband have to put together the desk that I just bought from Ikea. So when we put that together, I need to see exactly how long and wide it's going to be. That way I know if I want it to be on this wall in between the window and my closet door or if I want it to be against this wall. But I want to be able to look out of my bedroom, guest bedroom door. But yeah, we're going to figure that out. Today is Saturday, by the way. Um, my husband and I, we are getting ready to put together my desk. The one that I got from Ikea. And it's right here. And then down here is my heat press machine. I'm going to be doing an unboxing of that pretty soon. So make sure that you are stay tuned to my channel. Make sure that you are subscribed. And also give me a thumbs up. So this is the next day. Um, I did not pick the camera back up after we finished putting the desk together. And the desk looks so good. Um, it took about two hours. And yeah, so we finally finished it. I'm going to show you how the desk looks. What we did was we just used my old desk and turned it into an L-shaped. So um, I could just have more space. To work from as far as desk wise so um and then what i did was i just put down some clear vinyl so it can protect the carpet from the desk creating dents into the carpet so eventually i'm going to trim the excess off but i want to show you guys how it looks it looks so good Okay, so this is how it looks so far. So I decided to put the desk closer to the window so I can have the outer parts of the room set up with my other equipment. 
So I have all this other extra space to set up everything else. And then I'll only be able to exit from behind the desk on this side, which is fine. It's not a big deal. Um, who knows? Later on down the road, this whole setup could be rearranged. But as of right now, this is how I want it. This is how I like it. And like I said, I put the clear vinyl on the floor to protect the carpet from having dents in the carpet. So um, I will be trimming the excess vinyl that is showing as far as the longer pieces. But yeah, um, this desk is really long, just like I like it. Um, I have a lot of space to work from. So I'm going to get some drawer organizers to put in here just to not have everything scattered all over the place um but yeah so i really really like this desk this desk is from ikea if i did not say before um it has this this whole piece right here where you can um fish your cords through to plug into the wall as far as like whatever devices you may be using um just fish it through this hole and into the outlet probably won't be doing that maybe i will maybe i won't but um this desk like i said is from ikea and as you can see the bottom part of the desk is different on this side as you can see it's open and has a metal leg opposed to this side it's a solid piece of wood um, so that's kind of neat. I didn't have any issues about that when I first saw it. I just like the desk itself because it's long and it gives me a lot of working space. So yeah, this desk was $79 from Ikea and I went straight to Ikea and picked it up. Um, and they had plenty of stock this time around when I went to go get it. But yeah, um, I think the desk was pretty reasonably priced. Um, I've seen other desks that were priced higher than this one. And I was like, no, there's no way I'm going to be paying $120, $130. But I can go to Ikea and get a desk for less than $80. Bucks. Um, the only downside is if you don't like putting things together, building furniture, it may not be for you but it is worth it in the end or you can buy it and have somebody come out and um build it for you but that's going to be an extra fee and we weren't going to do that so my husband and i we put this together this is not the first piece of furniture that we have built from ikea um, or from any other store we've purchased other items that we had to build and we did it as a team as always so yeah but um the colors in here are going to be of course as you can see i like white because it makes the room look super bright and i'm going to be adding some pictures on the wall this is going to be my new recording space for youtube this is where all the magic will happen this is this is the office and um i'm very excited because now i have more space to do my work from home and to do my youtube and everything else t-shirts you know i'm super excited about all of that um you can't never go wrong with more space more space means you can just freely move around better and not have to worry about you know tight spaces so super excited about that but yeah so um eventually i will be doing um another video just you know decorating this whole space but i just wanted to come back on here and show you guys the finished product and then i do have some other things i need to bring in here that i'm going to be setting up So this is the um, SS cart that I was telling you guys about before in a previous video. So this will be set up in here. I'll probably have my Cricut machine on here like how it is in the picture on the box. 
Um, it also has some drawers in it that I can store different products and materials. And then this item is the 10 drawer rolling cart. And this has, of course, 10 drawers. So I can store numerous of things in this rolling cart as well. And one good thing about this cart is it's vertical and so it won't take up so much space against the wall yeah so that is basically it so i'm going to go ahead and end the video here and i hope that you guys enjoyed this vlog me and my husband setting up my new desk and if you have any questions um about any of the items that i showed you guys in this video from michael's or ikea leave them down below and i will see you guys in my next video